so they posted me recently in Lagos State to serve and I went into the camp and within two days I got chased out and this is the reason why I got chased out my experience at the camp actually from the first day I went to that place from the first day I got to the camp it just seems like my village people they followed me to that camp because I actually left where I am staying to go to Iyano Ipaja Iyano Paja I think that's how it's called and that's Agege that's where I was posted and then I got there very late I got there I think past seven and the people that was registering me really guys like I said my village people actually followed me to the camp the people that were registering said they are done for the day and then they actually told me to like come back the next day so I decided to ask a question to the woman that was in charge like I wanted to ask a question though she actually told me to come back tomorrow she said we should come back tomorrow by 1 p.m. and then I decided to ask the question then I entered a trap really guys I was just asking her what did I do ma what did I do ma the next thing she did was she said I should bring my color up later at first I was thinking okay maybe she wants to register me my naive brain never knew that I am back in Nigeria and being back in Nigeria means I am back to the system I am back to how they treat people I am back to how those people are the top no matter what no matter the post that these people have they will actually treat students like they are the governors of the states give them little power just small power like this they'll carry it on their head like like a room or rock. so she asked me to give her my call up letter and to me i was thinking okay she wants to register me then i gave her my call up letter the next thing she did was she snapped it before she asked me to give her the call up letter she has actually started telling me oh so i asked you to come back tomorrow and you still want to question me i asked you to come back by 1 p.m and you still want to question me i will discipline you i will do this i will do that i thought she was actually joking and then when i wanted to leave she said come here then i went to me i thought her mind has cleared maybe she has calm down from what is happening or you know, what is like what is disturbing at that night i actually believe that it might be stress but <clears throat> don't release your stress on student please we are also stressed out because i was in traffic for long i was in traffic for up to like two good hours i was in traffic and getting to that place just to not get a mental stress <laughs> I wasn't expecting it like I never expected it really guys I never really expected that and I wasn't expecting that actually so when she asked me to give her my call up letter I gave it to her thinking that she wants to register me like I said and, uh, the next thing she did was charm charm she snapped it ah ma what is the problem I started hearing I'm going to discipline you I will discipline you where were you in 1993 <laughs> where were you in 1993 I'm going to discipline blah 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 she was just telling me that i was like ah god though i've entered this bus trap what did i do the letter i just told myself okay, okay let me go since the other person was the other woman sitting by so i said okay just go go first maybe later on so i had to like leave that place and i had to i sat down for some time then i decided to okay let me go and meet this man again maybe there, there's something that i i asked her which she said to come back by one then i was not asking her around one that the next day by one will i be able to leave the camp so that was what i was trying to ask her before she was like i'm trying to question uh uh order i'm trying to question her order so i had to go back the next day she was like don't i don't want to see you just go where were you in 1993 that was when i served i served in 1993 if she asked me where were you in 1993 i kept telling her Ma, I'm sorry, I was not born then. <laughs> I wasn't born in 1993. You asked me when you in 1993. I said, Ma, I wasn't born then. She just kept doing that. I had to beg someone. I beg another woman to like talk to her because she was like showing me a card. She said she's the leader of the people registering um, students. So I had to beg two different people. So then after that, they had to like beg her for me, and then she said she has forgiven me. So that was my first experience at the camp. The next day was the day that they chased me out of the camp normally guys i was i was actually expecting going to the camp i'm going to spend like two days or probably four days to have the experience of being in the camp before coming out hey no, my expectations were cut short really my expectations were really cut short they i realized that they don't have much people they don't have uh, sorry they don't have much place for um people coming in to stay so they started chasing people that are married they started chasing us away like 
we should go back to our husband what i used to do here you should go back to your husband hi guys i'm cash rocks only cash rocks on instagram only cash rocks on youtube only cash rocks on facebook only cash rocks on your timeline hey that is a branded name for you guys so i'm one and only cash rocks on your screen and thank you for being here thank you for joining here thank you for listening to my yap yap my blab blab <laughs> because i'm here to blab for you guys and if you're here to subscribe to the channel what you waiting for what what you waiting for what are you waiting for please hit on that big red button that says subscribe and do not forget to thumbs up this video and also do not forget to share out this video because i'm going to be giving you guys one or two informations as regards nyz a lot of people have been chatting me and say ah, ah, are you going to post where is your videos where is your nyc videos are you not going to vlog are you not going to do that ah, your girl is out from the camp i am back home in my husband's house as i'm talking to you people right now i won't do that i won't vlog out no what you guys might actually see is pictures which which i'm going to be posting or probably you guys are seeing it already you're going to see pictures you're going to see some clips that i took i actually did some tiktok videos put that aside but as apart from that you guys the only picture you're going to see again or the only video you're going to see again might be on the on the 14th of february where we are going to be signing out of the camp i think that's what it's called now if you're watching this video and you're a married person maybe you're thinking oh i don't want to serve now because i'm married i don't know how my husband is going to react for me being in a particular place for three good weeks don't worry sis they're not going to allow you to stay that is pure fact they are not going to allow you to stay at first i was even thinking the person that told me that they're not going to allow me to stay i was actually thinking that okay well, it's possible that lagos state won't be like that it's possible that what she's saying might not be true maybe i'll go to lagos state now and then they will tell me you know you have to stay there for that three good weeks i've i've gotten things i bought my properties already i bought my things i bought things that i'm going to take to the camp and then i had to like speak to someone a friend of mine a classmate rather acquaintance that we went to we studied in the same department and she was also posted in lagos state so i had to like chat her up and ask her okay is lagos state also like this she told me ah they are going to send you away they are going to send you back i was like are you sure she said yes so that's why i had to like go with my school bag i just had to pick some things at first i've, I've actually prepared big box like you see the box i prepared very big even as i was asking are you going there to be forever so when she said that they don't allow people that are married to stay in the camp so i just had to like go back and repack my stuff into a school bag now when you get to that place what they are going to be singing they will tell you are you married yes you know you are going to go that is what they are going to ask you you are going to go <laughs> you tell them no problem ma you tell them no problem sir they'll tell you once once and they told me that once i was done with my registration that i'm going to be leaving before i even left before i was done with my registration they have actually brought my bag outside my bag was already outside waiting for me I think my school bag and my bucket that i took to that place was actually outside waiting for me already now the song that they are going to be singing for you is like what god has joined together nyc no go put us on that what god has joined together nyc no go put us on that <laughs> so a lot of you actually think i'm still in the camp i'm still jubilating i'm still camping i'm still doing all the you know otondo stuff match pass mm -mm. i was among the people that they said carry your bag and leave they were even telling me oh it's already late you say you're going to this place this night you say come and start going they're, they're, mm. guys they were already telling me what are you doing what are you still doing here oh yeah come and carry your stuff and start going come on. Eh? they were reminding me that i'm supposed to not be here up to this moment so my sisters and brothers in the lord your girl is back home <laughs> respectively i am back home to my husband's house and the only time i will go back to the camp is on the 14th of february so yeah yes I actually wanted to reply to some people that are asking me questions as regards the camp how is the camp going how are you camping with and all that but i know i'm going to create this content and i'm going to shoot this video for you people so i just stopped myself it's not better to just keep your mouth shut that you create this content because as a content creator everything is a content for us okay that's on the period okay so i wanted to just create this content so that's why i've not really been answering the questions and by the way i'm glowing i know i know drop it in the comment section tell me you're growing baby <laughs> 
I don't know why I'm so active this night. I think because I actually shot an impromptu video with my girls, my daughters, my sisters, and I'm going to be posting that video on Cash Rocks and Family. I have another channel which I have actually posted two videos on that channel, but this is going to be the next video I'm going to. The video I shot with them will be the next one I'm going to be posting on Cash Rocks and Family. So if you're here to subscribe to Cash Rocks and Family, you know you know how we do it right you know how we do it here head over to cash Rush and family and hit on that big red button that says subscribe on the channel and subscribe definitely already subscribe to this channel and also i'm going to be linking the channel link on this description box on this video description box so don't worry you're not going to miss out you're not going to miss out on quality content amazing beautiful content okay so guys uh, your guy is overactive already so like i said earlier on don't be scared if you're married you won't be allowed to stay in the camp maybe the next one just put yourself apply the only thing you're going to go to the only thing that you're going to go do is to register and then you're out of the camp like yeah your husband will not miss you that much <laughs> your husband will not miss you that much and your, your people your, ch your children your kids they're not going to miss you that much just go and register and then they'll send you back you go back to your your, your husband's house and why you cannot put that on that so that is it for my gist with you guys tonight guys that is it for my experience at nyc camp i did not have much i don't have much experience at the camp but this little one i have i decided to share it with you guys because you know what i don't like keeping secret from you people right i don't like keeping gist from you people thank you for watching and see you guys on my next video until then, I love you. Bye.